Joined by Hofstra Volleyball Head Coach Emily Mansour following her team's three-set sweep of conference rival Northeastern. Coach, first question, obviously, the third set start off, so like a lot of them have lately when you came back. Can you just talk about what you were able to do in that third set to win it finally? And I think they are starting to understand the urgency of coming back and not going through such a hole. And today, because it just happened the other day, they knew how important it would be for us to win that third game. It's still a very slow start, and we know that's a very dangerous zone to be at, but it's a step better than the last match because we won. But still very far than what we need to be. Coach, uh Veronica was very good in the first set, and Kelsey was obviously very good throughout. Can you just talk about their efforts tonight? Um, both of the outsides. I mean, Kelsey, Kelsey has been our best, more consistent player throughout the season. She is getting more help, which gives us her a little time to be able to really rise at the end of the match. Uh, Veronica is stepped up a lot, but again, we need the consistency from Veronica for the whole match, and she's starting to get it you know, by the end of the season when we really need she's going to be there because every game we see a little better from Veronica. What's been going so well in the second sets lately that allow you to win those sets almost convincingly almost every time right now? I think with the second game, they really see that our game plan is working, they trust 100%, they're ready, mind, which is the most important thing, is there, and we are ready to be successful in the second game, the second sets, because they have the mind and the body 100% there, and then we get close. Uh, Coach, can you talk about uh, how you plan to fix the consistency of the passing? It kind of seems to be what makes or breaks you guys. We've been working on that on every practice, giving them a lot of pressure scenarios that they have to work with. So when we get here, we are able to maintain a level. Today they started very well, and again, we had a little break. But we see a little improvement, and that's all we need day by day because by the end of the season, we'll be where we need to be. Very uh, tight first and third set. Does that concern you at all looking ahead to Friday? I mean, Friday is a whole different thing. It's the team that was picked to finish the first on the conference. They have won every match. They are a very strong team. It's a tough week for us because we are coming from so many playing where they had the whole week off. But it's a fun match, and we are looking forward to go there and play a good volleyball. Coach, it seems like your team is able to find ways to victory no matter what the circumstances, whether it's an outright victory or if they have to battle back, especially in conference play. Is there a mindset that you're trying to instill in these players for that purpose, or what is it that they're doing so well to just come back and find ways to win? The mindset for our team is every point is important. It doesn't matter the first, the second, the first game or third game, and we keep telling that. That's the discipline between first point to last point, and I think this is helping us a lot to understand that no matter if we are down and you are disciplined, it will still fight for anything can happen. So we keep talking to them a lot about that, and uh, it's working on those crunch times, but we don't want to have so many crunch times anymore. What about Sophia Black? Uh, talk about her play and, and maybe what concerns you and what, what she needs to work on. Um, Sophia was better today in terms of her service. We just have such a high expectation for her because we know the talent and the potential that she has and we're just going to keep pushing her because she can't get comfortable. She has a long way to go and today she had moments that she was playing okay the volleyball that we want and then she would get comfortable and go back to old habits that we want to try to shine away from. Coach, can you just talk about now looking ahead to Friday, like you kind of mentioned it there, how exciting is Friday's match for your student athletes to play in a game of that magnitude this early in the year in the conference schedule? Oh, they're very excited. They know this is a team that it's the favorite. Uh, it's going to be a good test for us. Anything can happen when we go there and we get to see them again, but they're very excited to get a chance to play College of Charleston. Our mind, our body, we are taking care to make sure we are there on 100%.